The access control of the project can be done through the permission setting in Teamwork Server or through the password lock in the diagram. So let me show you how these two approaches work. And we first try the permission setting and we'll create a user with a read-only permission and then he will check out the project, modify it and then commit it back to the server. And now let's try to open the BPVA. Uh, let's try to the, the, the first create a user in the Teamwork Server. We add a user. Let's say we call the user as uh, John. And you can see there's a permission box in here. This is only for the controlling the administrative permission of the user and which is not that specific to the project we, we are working on, so we just ignore it. And then we press the add user button, we got the John, which is an active user. Now we go to the project tab and create a new project. Name the project as uh, Travel Booking and then we import an existing project file. And we select John as a read only user. And add project. Now the project is ready and we try to go uh, try to uh, log in through the BPVA. We open the Timber client. We log in with uh, John. And then we press OK. And we add the project to draft booking. Now we check out the project and open it. Now we try to modify a task in the, in the diagram. Like this. And we commit the changes. Now you will see it, uh, it complain that the user didn't have the permission to commit. So through the permission in the server, you can protect your diagram. Uh, not being modified by uh, other user. So uh, now let's try to uh, let's go back to the PowerPoint. Okay, now we will try to use the uh, password lock in the diagram. We will create a new user with a read write permission, and we will also grant the write permission to John, the existing user. After that, the new user will check out the project and lock the lock diagram with the password lock and commit back. And after that, John will update the project from the server. So just like he's, uh, it, it, it is actually the same to check out the project which already locked it. And he will try to modify the diagram. So we go to the Teamwork Server Administrative Administration website and we switch to user tab. We add a new user, say uh, Mary. And go to the project tab. Select the travel booking. And we first remove John from the list. And then select both John and Mary and add as a read and update. Save the changes. So now you will see both John and Mary uh, got the read and update permission to this, to this project. And now we switch to another incidence of the BPVA. So this one will simulate the login of uh, Mary. Now she will open the Timber client. And then log in. Log in the 
Ernest and Mary. And uh, she'll add the project. It's travel booking. Press OK. Check out and open the project. Now let's uh, lock the diagram by using the password. Right click on the project and then select the diagram content, lock, and then specify the password. Now commit it back to server. see only one thing is, is actually modified which is the lock property so press ok now the now the diagram is being locked and can commit the server let's switch to uh, John so uh, previously he modified the task and we first revert the change so now it is back to the, the very very beginning stage now he update this project from server after the update the diagram should carry the log which just like a uh, check our project after Mary lock the diagram now let's try to modify the di modify the diagram by uh, move the task a little bit on the right so when you see when uh, when try to take any, any action on the diagram uh, uh, of authorization box will, will be show up and ask you to specify the password and if you don't have the password you can't modify the diagram so what well, John didn't have the password so he can only press cancel and he cannot do anything on the diagram so uh, let's see let's try to modify another diagram for example the book of accommodation So we'll just add the word with the price list in here and now we try to commit. You can see John can commit the changes because the the diagram book accommodation is not being locked. So with the password lock you can fine tune the permission on the diagram base. So uh, only the authorized person can work on specific diagram.